Hi there, this is Mrs. Vaughn. I am here with a short video, less than three minutes, I promise, on how to use the cross multiplication method to help with your stoichiometry problems. So anytime we have a stoichiometry problem, we have to start with a balanced equation. Here, one has already been provided for us. Our example problem reads, if 1.5 moles of carbon monoxide is reacted completely, how many moles of nitrogen will be produced? Since we're doing the cross multiplication, we are going to set up a proportion. It's going to look something like this. So we have on the left our reactant that we already know. So that's our carbon monoxide. So that's what we have set up on the left. On the right is what we want. So on the left is what we have. On the right is what we want. So to explain these numbers, my mole ratio numbers are highlighted here in pink. If we look up at our balanced equation, these mole ratio numbers are exactly the same as the coefficients. So these numbers in pink represent your mole ratio numbers and will be exactly the same as the coefficients in your balanced chemical equation. Our numbers on the bottom represent our moles. So on the bottom left, we have the moles that we were given in the problem, 1.5 moles of carbon monoxide. On the right, I'm not given any information about this nitrogen that I want. So I have therefore used the variable x to represent that I don't know what that is, but I want to find out. We're going to set up a cross multiplication problem, which means we're going to multiply the pink numbers and the blue numbers times each other, and we'll set those equal to each other. So after we finish our cross multiplication, we're going to have 2x equals 1.5 moles times 1. To get x by itself, we need to divide both sides by 2, which means x here is going to equal 0 0.75 moles, which tells us how much nitrogen can be produced from 1.5 moles of carbon monoxide. This was the cross multiplication method for solving stoichiometry problems. If you have any further questions, please don't hesitate to reach out and I'll do what I can to help you. Thank you and good luck.